Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki, and when it comes to medical problems, I know that an enlarged heart is not good. But in the spiritual realm, having a bigger heart is important. We're called to have hearts as open and as big with love as the heart of Jesus. Chiara Lubish, an Italian Catholic woman who founded a movement called Focolare and who died in 2008, has some words about this that I'd like to share with you today. She wrote, we must enlarge our hearts in imitation of the heart of Jesus. How much hard work this is! However, it is the only thing needed, and when this is done, everything is done. It is a matter of loving each person we meet as God loves him or her. Our important task is that of keeping the chastity of God, which means keeping love like that of Jesus in our hearts. Thus, in order to be pure, we must not deprive the heart and suppress love in it, but rather enlarge it like the heart of Jesus and love everyone. And just as one blessed host out of the thousands on earth is enough to nourish us with God, so one brother or sister, the one with whom God's will places us in contact, is enough to place us in communion with humanity, which is the mystical Jesus. And being in communion with our brother or sister is the second commandment, the one which comes immediately after that of loving God and is an expression of it. I like that image that Chiara uses, how one small consecrated host contains the whole Jesus, body and blood, soul and divinity, including his sacred heart. And so each person that we meet is like that host, made in God's image and likeness, and made precious by the precious blood of Jesus that was shed for him or her. Truly, when we love the people God has placed in our lives, we are loving God himself.